In this demonstration, we'll show how information workers create, review, approve, and edit content within an easy-to-use desktop environment. Working with content is often a collaborative endeavor. Team spaces are environments for collaborating on projects. Content Navigator enables a line of business project manager to easily set up a team space for collaboration. I simply click New Team Space and I'll name it. Let's say we're a real estate marketing firm and we're planning a home loan contest. We'll do it in Q2. And now notice below some predefined team space templates. I'll select Marketing Project because that has all the predefined settings we'll need for search types of documents and the folders are all set up. Now I need to select the usernames that I want on the project. And I'll look at uh, what we've got already set up. And uh, I definitely need Joe on this one. And I'll give Joe access the way he needs to do his job. So now we have a team space with secure access and permissions and we can get started on the project. You'll see that I can easily add a document by dragging and dropping the file into the team space and then I press add. Now I want to suggest an edit to the team regarding this document so I'll add a comment. Please replace drawing with a photo. You'll notice that each comment is added to a specific version. I can tag the document to help my team search for it later. And I can like the document. Now by clicking on the document, it launches an HTML5 viewer, which meets the security requirements for most organizations. I can scroll down and I can add an annotation. Maybe I need someone to confirm that this is the correct dollar amount. Then I save the annotation and close the document. Now I want to kick off a workflow to get this document reviewed and completed. So I'm using the out-of-the-box workflow and I will select a colleague Sue Ryan, and I can add a note of instruction on it for Sue. And this task will now show up in her work queue with a link to the document. Let's jump ahead. Sue has reviewed the document and determined that we need to work on it together. So we'll launch Office Online and we'll begin to edit together. When the document opens, I can see that Sue Ryan is already making some edits and indeed she has corrected the dollar amount that I was concerned about. But wait, I can see that this date is incorrect and so I will edit as well. Now let's take a look at what happens when a colleague is out of the office. They can use an iOS or Android mobile device to navigate to the team space. And there is the same document. There's the comment that I added. So let's say the graphic artist on the team is out in the field and ready to replace the drawing with the photo as I requested. Once the artist takes the photo, then they go into their camera roll and they select the image. They can add some metadata to tag the document. And when they click add, it's available in the team space. In this demonstration, we saw a team collaborating on the creation of content within a team space. We saw how to set up a team space, how to add documents to the team space with various features that help the collaboration process, we saw how to work in tandem on the same document with simple workflow and Office Online. And finally, we saw how to access a team space from a mobile device.